Natural rubber is a unique renewable resource that remains an essential ingredient in tires. As one of the world's largest buyers of natural rubber, Michelin is fully committed to sustainable and responsible management of this raw material and is very active across the entire natural rubber supply chain to advance the best industry practices. In 2015, Michelin and Burrito Pacific Group created a joint venture, Royal Lestari Utama, RLU, to develop responsible rubber tree plantations in two provinces in Indonesia, ravaged by uncontrolled and illegal deforestation and fires over past years. The project involves a partnership with WWF to design deforestation-free rubber plantations together with the local communities while providing expertise in protecting fauna and flora. The goal is to restore a large area of 90,000 hectares and provide alternative ways of living to local population through regular incomes, consistent with a landscape restoration approach. Regaining control over this devastated area will be key to set up a buffer zone to protect the threatened national park of Bukit Taiga Pulu, one of the richest on the planet where elephants, tigers and orangutans live together. Rubber trees will be planted on 40% of this heavily deforested area, situated in the provinces of Jambi in Sumatra and northeast Kalimantan in Borneo. The remaining surface will be set aside for community livelihoods and conservation. Keen to protect natural forests and areas of high environmental value, Michelin advocates a responsible land management approach, keeping a balance between natural rubber plantations and conservation areas. Over 50% of the area is dedicated to the conservation of fauna and flora also serving as water catchment area to provide water supply to the local community. The remaining deforested areas are rehabilitated to become an economically productive land, which uphold the best agricultural practices and ensure positive social and environmental impacts. Rubber cultivation also acts as an effective carbon trap, reducing the effects of global warming. Housing, schooling, and various training sessions to promote best practices in terms of rubber cultivation are put in place with the local communities. In 2017, RLU started the production of high-quality, sustainable natural rubber in its new processing facility, employing 70% of workers from the local community. Producing around 30,000 tons per year, this factory will have a significant impact on rubber development in the province. At maturity, this challenging project is expected to provide approximately 16,000 direct or indirect long-term and stable local jobs, while promoting growth, social development and environmental protection that will be very beneficial for the planet.